there this is me red and welcome back to my channel well what i'm having to you right now is a makeup tutorial that is perfect for first dates yeah so we all know that girls really get so nervous when it comes to first dates we want to look great but we don't want to look so overrated so here's my tips for you ladies out there so first wear a not too heavy makeup just enough to accentuate the feminine feature of yours. Second, wear a brown smoky eyes. Not too dark, just a little bit light for you to complement the sparkle of your eyes. Yes. And third, wear a red lipstick. So guys are always attracted to a red lip. And fourth, just wear a light colored shirt or dresses like white or beige in order for you to look so classy. And fifth, just be confident, be yourself. Yes. And always remember that you're beautiful. Well, anyway, guys, so he, now I'm going to teach you how I did this makeup. So stay watching. So let's start with foundation and since I haven't been out in the sun for quite a while now so I'm gonna use the Reblon Color Stay 240. So I usually used a toned um, foundation but now let's use this one. So let's get messy a little bit and then we're gonna use the BYS blending sponge. Next is the concealer. Um, it's from Revlon Candid Concealer 050. So that's what we're gonna use next. As what Priyana said, concealers are to cover the dark circles, the hangovers, the bad decisions. Yeah. Let's blend it in with the same sponge. Yeah, on the other side. And then next is the BYS Contour Stick. Yeah, and it's um, in bronze shade. So let's put some contour to give an illusion that we have a slimmer face. Yeah, so on the nose, from here, the other side. And here on our forehead and on the side. Here on the jaw. Let's blend it up upwards. Just like that. From here. Other side. Down the jawline. And let's not forget the nose. Ta-da! Next is the powder from Revlon. And let's use the powder brush from H&M. We're gonna set this foundation on our face with this powder. Next one is the BYS Matte Bronzing Powder. So I'm gonna use the 233 brush from Nichido. Then let's gonna brush it on our nose. Then here, let's contour our eyes as well. Eyeshadow palette. First shade we're gonna use is this brown right here. This one. 
with um, the 231 brush from Nietzsche Do. On the other side, blend it in with the eye color brush from H&M. Let's just blend the edges. Next is this one. This shade right here with um, the H&M crisp blending brush. Then let's contour this eyeshadow. Just do it like circle like that and then brush and then do it repeatedly. And then blend it in. So let's not forget to blend the edges every time. And here on the other side. And then next, this comes with my eyeshadow palette. This brush comes with my eyeshadow palette from um, Naked Urban Decay. So this is what I'm gonna use for this shade right here. We're gonna put it on the brow bone to highlight our eyeshadow. Blend it a little bit. Next is um, the Maybelline uh, gel liner. So this comes next. Let's create some wing eyeliner. So done with the eyeliner. Next is our eyebrows. So we're gonna use the LA Girl Brow Pomade and brush it on our eyebrows. And then this Novo Designing Eyebrows. So it, it kind of like looked like this. We're gonna use this color right here, this one, and brush it on our brows. Ta-da! So we now have our eyebrows. And this one's next for MAC. It's a, a bronzer, dark deepest bronzer for MAC. And we're gonna use the H&M angled brush for that. So we're gonna bronze the side of our face to give us some glow. Here. This is the next one, Very Berry from Rivlon. So we're gonna use the blusher brush from H&M for that. This one's next from MAC and the highlighting fun brush from H&M. I really love to put some highlighter on my face. So we're gonna use some red lipstick today. And this one's my favorite ever red lipstick from MAC and Ruby Woo for MAC. So yeah, this is the shade. So this is kind of like my everyday lipstick as well. So, um, let's not forget the mascara. I almost forgot.
And then next, we're just gonna fix our hair and we're ready to go. Yeah, and voila. So here's the final look. I already fixed my hair. So I'm ready to go. So see you in my next vlog. Ciao.